Okay, so I have the uh, frame output panel out of the TV and I have it on the bench. Uh, most of these early colour TVs are modular construction. The various panels plug in and out. And that was to help the rental trade. So you go into someone's house, you could just you could quickly diagnose which panel was a fault and swap it out. And then you'd bring that panel back to the workshop and you'd always have a surplus of panels ready to swap in and out, which made in the house servicing quicker. So the panel's out, it's a bit dusty, so I'm gonna give it a bit of an old brush off. I can already see something that's probably causing our problem. And we can see here that the uh, one of the electrolytics has let go in a big way. So that probably happened some time ago. It didn't happen when I powered it on. So maybe someone powered it on before. But it certainly it went with a bang. You would have heard him going. So it's a talent. These are generally regarded as replace on site item. Anyway, whether they're really good or not. 250 microfarad at 25 volts. So I'm going to route one of those out and we'll change it and we'll see where we go from there. <clears throat> right, so I dug out a 220 microfarad 63 volt cap. So I'm just going to start pulling out this one. should start using solar bread. Anyway, our new cap is in. Oh, there. If we look closely here, R258 appears to be have been taken out in the process. And it looks like it's red, red, brown, which would be 220 ohms. So, I may go and find one of those as well. Right, so I dug out a 220 ohm resistor. So we get this yoke out. had it anyway so I'd imagine what happened is the electrolytic went short and then the resistor burned up sort of makes sense
These Pi 697s, well, it's not the greatest television ever made. They can be made, give a reasonable account of themselves. Although they were known for going on fire. We'll talk about that later on. The focus BDR at the side, which is has the full EHT across it, used to go on fire and set fire to your curtains and stuff, which wasn't great. on the road so here we can see expert camera work here at play here is C256 the 250 electrolytic and was burst open and here's our 220 or 258 which is 220 ohms which was burned open circuit so he went short and he went open so that would probably account for our poor height as our transistor here wouldn't be getting switched so we'll uh, We'll bang the panel back in and we'll see what it does now. Right, so we're back now. We have the frame panel back in, so we'll try it now. See how we get on. Ah, we're looking a bit better now. All right, 